Look at me. I get to uh, fish with one of my sales guys and the infamous Greg Mangus, world famous Greg Mangus, right? <laughs> Say hi, Greg. You get to take me out on a on a lake today called Lake George or George Lake, one of the two. Beautiful, purely clean, crisp water. See, they, they even know him. Hey, guys, how you doing? Good. <laughs> Follow me on YouTube. Red Shores. <laughs> so, anyways, I got my boy. We drove two and a half days to be here. Yeah. yeah. And but, uh, Greg's going to take us out here. My son, we're going to fish and have a barbecue tonight. Hopefully, you guys enjoy today's episode. And of course, see Flash Crank Thanks. Got to see him too. He hand makes them. We got one in the boat. <laughs> that is a green fish. They are pretty. They are. Right there. Okay. Dink. Bigger than the first dink. Yeah, oh, way better. That's a 12 inch dink. What do you do? You eat that on the fall? <laughs> yeah, you did. Is that a 12 inch keeper size? It's 14 inches in Michigan. What's the size on that in Idaho? 12. 12. <laughs> Definitely into the keeper uh, trophies. That's what the part it is, though, man. When you start fishing, then all of a sudden they get bigger and bigger and bigger. You know. You know, as I know, it's timing. Timing. And <laughs> it's the blade. Remember, we talked. I said, if I catch one, it'll be a nice one, and it'll have the blade. Look at that, son! Look at me! Next about an average keeper here. Woo, look at that! That's like yellow. It's, it's the uh, clear water fishing in the yeah. grass. And it causes them to, to be that way. Isn't that a beautiful color though? It's alright. That's why you buy a hundred packs of them. Look at there. We're gonna let it. What's to say, Andrew? On my arm, cold wind, right? Oh yeah. Call the wind, guys. Here we go. <laughs> Yay me. Hey, I didn't get skunked. Oh, you won't get skunked. <laughs> you never get skunked. Did you get skunked yet? Oh, yeah, you still are. <laughs> I sit down to take a break for a few seconds. Catch a fish. That's right. When you sit down, I catch the fish. Make you stand back up, huh? Yeah, so you can't catch the fish. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Woo. Looky there. Greg caught my fish. No! <laughs> I wanted a fish on film. Well, you promise? I promise. <laughs> huh? That was probably two and a half. Wasn't that about two and a half? I'd say at least that. Ah, oh, well, we got to jump, I think, on camera. Uh, and look at this, I, I I caught a fish, lost it real quick, and then I reeled this up. <laughs> Yay me! <laughs> no! The dirty dog! How did he break? He got off in the grass on me! 
Don't be filming me. <laughs> I'm filming you. No, nope, you're not supposed to film me losing a fish. Ah. <laughs> That's your design, huh? We gotta keep that a secret for a little while. <laughs> Catch one, Andrew. We're waiting all day. You didn't drive 27 hours for you not to catch a fish. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Look at Andrew got one. Look at this, look at this. In the boat. But you act like a pro yeah. when you break that in. Oh, two, two minute penalty. You have to sit down. Look at you, son. Do you need to get them baby hands to man hands so that you can sure. hang on to that fish a little bit there? Well, he flips wrong right when I'm trying. Way to go, Andrew. He showed up. Me and my big mouth. Nice. I think that's like <laughs> one of my first fish out of, out of the state of Idaho. Outside of the state of Idaho? Oh, yeah. No, you caught one on Chasta. One. Several. <laughs> Several. That's your first largemouth in where? Indiana. Michigan. Or are we in Indiana? No, we're in Michigan. Well, we're in... Actually, we are probably in Indiana right now. Yeah, so yeah. Michigan waters, Indiana. So you're on the state line. That's your first out of state, that's what do you call it, Midwest? My, out of West Coast. It's my first fish out of the West Coast. Yeah. Unless okay. you count. Not the well, my first no. bass out of the West Coast, because I don't oh, count the draw that I caught in Lake Michigan. The West Coast. Away from the mountains. Right, away from the well, yeah, away from the mountains. Yeah, I don't really count. Yeah. But that's your first largemouth. Yeah, outside of the West Coast. Yep. There you go, bud. Again? You know what I did? You broke your line. I was gonna flip him, so I back reel when I fight him. And I flip <laughs> my, my back reel back. Oh! <laughs> you fish and much? Since, and since we're not too serious. Are we fish much? <laughs> Is he buried up? And four hopes. Got you all set up. Yeah. <laughs> That's not a rookie there. That was that was a pure pro Perf move. Professional. Professional. Drop. That was a professional catch and drop. <laughs> Let's see what it is. They're out here on this outer edge. It seems like you've caught. Could be a pike, but he's coming up. Look at that largey. That's a almost a three pounder. If not, close, right? Let's don't uh, let's don't noob uh, boat flip that one. Let's get that one in. Look at all this the, the fry in the water right there. See it? Use this garden fry. <laughs> yeah, not that fry. That's something else. That's your emerald shiners, aren't those? You're gonna get that one for me. I'll grab it. 
Leggy there. Grasshopper. Thank you, sir. That might be three and a half. You would have won your tournament. <laughs> Probably. These are, these are stocky. Yeah, that's... Is that a rare fish here? No. Oh, that's common? Fairly common. Ah. Okay, move forward. All right. And we'll find out. What it weighs? I'm going to guess three and a quart. We'll get my Rapala scale out. No, no, no. Don't say that out loud. You're using the AccuCall. Look at this. See? I know. I'm kidding you. you can't say that other name. You, you it's a nasty that. name. Okay. What's your guess? Three and a quart. 275. Oh my gosh. I was only off a half. What'd you think? Holding. I want to show you. Remember what I told you about my scale? Hang on one sec. Let's do that after. This is the um, first scale. The I very first had. version. Yep. <laughs> there it is, 275. Every time. <laughs> nice. Hey, that was a professional release, too. I saw that all at once. Look at that. Good job, man. So, you know, I was kidding. Get him out! <laughs> Good job, Andrew. Yes. Look at you. Put that on film. <laughs> you got leeches in his mouth. Touch one. No. With your tongue. No. Ah, look at you, son. Ready? No. Hold it up. Hey, let's get a picture from Mama. You want to weigh that one? Nah, it's all right. It's a two pounder, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's got to be two and a quart. He was right. There. Right on top of that clump, that grass down there. I was reeling. I was like, what's that? Oh. <laughs> right on, buddy. It is. So fatty. I'm running the camera and trying to fish at the same time. It didn't work so well. There you go. There's number 11 in my life with the chatterbait. Not very big, but. Hey, thanks, Andrew, for being so nice and grabbing it for your dad. Look at you. I'm dead. The camera being in a charge situation, and he flipped it. Yeah, get you, get your glasses all wet like you. Yeah, I hate that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that giant! You need help. I want to? Let's do the professional thing. What is that? Reach down the lip. Grab the line and they jump off. That's when they do it. Every time. <laughs> There's your four pounder. Look at that. Maybe five. Yeah, four. Nice fish. Thank you. Oh, I think I got it. Good oh, job. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're fine. I keep thinking I'm just fishing. This. You are fishing, but we're catching and that's what we're getting on film and that's what it's all about for my son and, and I'm thankful for you taking us out for today. I'm enjoying it. This is awesome. Now if I just give my son to catch one that big, that'd be even greater.
Look at there. We'd be blowing this tournament away today. Because I got with, lucky. With what we've caught. Yeah. We've been almost all of them. So, you know. Yeah. Nice fish. <laughs> I stop to grab the camera every time I just bury up. <laughs> Look at those fish in the water, bud. Woo! Woo! You gonna grab my fish for me? Sure. Dad? Look at that one. Weigh it. We Should we weigh it? Yeah. Let's wait. Let's do a little thing with my scale. Yeah. A little over. Look at that, huh? Pull up to the cameras. The only thing my screen will blacken if I lay it. Just all of them do. But is it turned on? Yeah. Okay. Three o two. <laughs> You're smarter than me. Look at that! Oh yeah. Here we go, buddy. God. Looks like Daddy showed up to the party. Big old melon head. Look at the spots on the fins, huh? Oh yeah. I just thought I'd throw the chatterbait long enough that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think chatterbait sucks still. I don't like chatterbait. Okay, I'm up to 12 now on it. Two today. Two in one day. Wow, I'm breaking a record. You only had three today. I had one hit it, but two that I got in the boat. The one that hit it, I think I just bumped into a bluegill. <laughs> anyway. Woo! That's not bad. Well, Just, Graham, nobody I'm, can beat us today with what we have. Well, that's awesome. If we were in a tournament. Right. Of course, we would you know, probably share some of those. Of course. Is it a team event? Yeah. That, we're into the 15 pound mark ding there. The only individual ones I've been sure that they call them Indy League Fishing, which uh -huh. is that middle one. Okay. They're where you're weighing down the water. Right. And pretty soon maybe we talk them into using my new waterproof scale for that, which I'll give you tomorrow or tonight for a free steak. <laughs> I didn't tell you it was not free. <laughs> He's trying to bury you up good, isn't he? Get out of there. I see him down. Oh, he gets off. It can be trouble with him. Make up for the one you that got off in the grass. Playing it like he's big. Nah, he's not big. You go right for that grass again. <laughs> Didn't lose that one. Dang it. I wish they got that other one. That other one was a puppy, a three pounder that you love. That got Mary Jug. That is a lake Idaho. mead. That's, that is a, lake. that's a big one for lake mead. That's an Idaho keeper right there. <laughs> I'm like, whoa. <laughs> What's that? I'm like, whoa, yeah. Dude, what is I have to catch three chatterbait fish in front of you, and he keeps telling me I need to get confidence in it. And... What are you, what are you, what are you There's this, look what he puked up. Whoop. Yeah. Uh, come here, you. No, that's the baby large enough. He's eating his own kind. Where? Yep. He's a. Very nice. Someday. This 
see. Make it a seven. Oh, nice fish. Look at this fish. Here. <laughs> of course, if I start over there, by the time you can't, you can only fish for four hours, an hour without, then you got to oh. item over here. So. I got plugged. I got him. Double. Double. Oh, wow. one. Cool. I had to slow it down and, Andrew, go ahead and film him grabbing his fish. I'll both flip mine, or you got us both. You got a big I one. got you both in. Same size. <laughs> Here's a double. I had to catch another one in front of Greg Mangus. <laughs> Number four. Number four on the chatter bay. Hold them back to back. We can probably pull. Nah, this is bigger. I finally lost my worm. Finally? It's about yeah. time. He's kicking my butt on it. Oh, the chatter bump's on fire. Ready? We're gonna let this one go. Film him letting his go, and I'll just catch another one while he's letting his go. Yeah, while well, I'm digging out a bait. <laughs> Anything to say? Hey, time out. Frank. What's that? Time out? No, no such thing as time out in, in sports. <laughs> <laughs> Anything to say? <laughs> Anything to say? Hey, we got a double. Right? Yeah. Sputters? Yeah. Pole benders? Yeah. But the reason we call them sputters is because we fish ice a lot. And when uh -huh. you're catching them, you guys come over and sput a hole next to you. Ah. Uh. So we call them sputters. <laughs> when they do that. Which? Three keepers here. Three decent keepers. They wouldn't go in our bag today, though, I don't think. Would they? No, no, you're, those wouldn't even go. All right, we're going to call this a day with Greg and my son out here on Lake George in Michigan. And uh, caught a lot of large now today. Probably best five would probably definitely hit 15 pounds. And, uh, I think he was holding one of the buttons down, but he calculated. He's a mathematician, he says. But I want to thank you, Greg. I appreciate everything you do. Yep. I appreciate everything you do, and I had to catch five fish on a chatterbait in front of him. I'm kind of frustrated. It's the most I've ever caught in one day, ever. But it was a good time. My kid caught some fish, decent ones. I caught some decent ones, and uh, Greg caught some really decent ones, but of course, it's his water. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Appreciate it. What do you say? Uh, bye, Axel. <laughs> Call the wind.